Hello everyone. So um, this is an important reminder about one of the world's biggest issues, bullying. And this is not a joke or a laughing matter. This is serious and very important to know. Every moment of every day, someone is getting bullied, either online or in person. Bullies gain their power by taking power away from others, by making them feel scared, vulnerable, alone, and helpless. Because of this, mental health issues are at risk, and suicide rates are constantly rising, among other reasons. Bullying causes stress, fear, insecurity, depression. It can lead to self-harm, sickness, sometimes bad choices like addictions, and even suicide. But it doesn't have to be this way anymore. In a way, we've probably all dealt with bullying or been guilty of it in some way, shape, or form. But this has to stop. We deserve better, and we are capable of better. There are enough circumstances going on in the world and within our own personal lives that we do not need to add to it with unnecessary hate, criticism, and negativity. Spread love. Also, remember that someone could be going through a tough time even if they don't seem like it on the outside, or even if they countlessly say that they're okay when they're actually not. So just be kind to everyone. Check in with your friends, be a good person, and to those struggling with bullying and with mental health, remember your worth. Seek help. Do not suffer in silence. You are so strong, but you do not have to deal with this alone. Also, most importantly, know that you are loved. You matter. You are needed on this earth. And trust me, I know what it's like to feel vulnerable and unable to open up to people. I've been there before. Like millions of other people around the world, I too struggle with mental health. I struggle with anxiety and ADHD. During the pandemic, I had to do virtual learning. And since I had to be socially distanced from everyone and listen to the news of people dying from COVID and sh or shootings, I also had to face comments online full of hate and criticizing opinions and threats. It all made my anxiety even worse. I didn't know who to trust due to my fear of criticism and being a burden, so I fell into a deep depression. But with the help of my parents, my friends, my teachers, and my support team, I was able to overcome those negative feelings and heal and hold on to hope that everything was going to be okay, and they were right. But even if some of those hateful comments I've seen online didn't have anything to do with me, I was still affected by them because I care very deeply for people around the world. No matter what they look like, no matter who they are, no matter what flaws they have, we are all human beings with strengths and weaknesses and feelings. We all share the sun, the earth, and the sky. We are all one family on this earth, a part of nature. Even if we are strangers and don't know each other, we are still family on this earth, true human beings. That's what we all have in common. God give you a, a mouth, so understand and believe that you have the capacity to use that mouth for the good and not for the bad. In 2018, my idol and role model, Millie Bobby Brown, won an MTV award for best lead actress for Stranger Things, and she said a very important quote, if you don't have anything nice to say, just don't say anything. She went through online bullying on Twitter and TikTok, which made her quit both. She needed to speak out for what was going on around the world. So most importantly, think before you speak. Use that mouth that God gave you to seek help if you are struggling and to reach out to loved ones who are struggling. If you see something wrong, say something. Be aware of your surroundings. Open your eyes, listen, and don't let fear silence you. What's important is kindness. Continue to do the right thing by being a safe place for someone to trust. Continue to make social media in every school, including here, a positive, peaceful, healthy, and safe, and safe environment full of love, compassion, loyalty, healing, joy, and support. Let's work together and bring ourselves together. You are not alone. There are people who care so much about you and are willing to listen if you seek help. You have rights. And we can do it together. We can do this. I believe in you. But not only you need one or two people to believe in you, but you also need to believe in yourself. In one of my favorite Disney movies, Cinderella, the live action one, Cinderella's mother said to her the famous one touching quote that inspires us all. 
Have courage and be kind. We all need love. Look at what's right in front of you and all around you. Never lose sight of what's very important. Friendship, family, love, your well-being, protection, security, acceptance, stability, and your future. Don't ever lose hope. Hope is the key to survival. You just need to find that one thing inside you that makes you strong, something that makes you want to live. It's in there. Search deep into your inner core and you'll find your truth and your purpose of what you are meant to do. And trust your gut, listen to your heart, and be, be insightful. And I know it's a lot of pressure. Trust me, I feel it too. But just take it one step at a time. You have your whole life ahead of you. So don't take life and everything and everyone that's near and dear to you for granted. Believe me, I know you'll do great. Thank you. I love you all.